Right, so we need to find uh, the product here um, in this uh, particular uh, type of chemical reaction in organic chemistry. And uh, we look at this uh, with much caution and we present uh, the solution. So the couple of things uh, we need to first uh, take note of, um, the fact that we are actually reacting in alkene together with um, a hydrogen bromide. And so um, this reaction itself constitutes what we call the hydrohalogenation. And uh, the solution is as follows. So we present the solution right now. Right, so we start with hydrogen. Another hydrogen. The double bond. Then you have hydrogen. Then you have hydrogen, hydrogen, hydrogen. Okay, it reacts with hydrogen bromide. And in this chemical reaction, what we're able to achieve is that the hydrogen in the hydrogen bromide will actually be such that it will be attached to the hydrogen that has the most hydrogen atoms. And so or the, the, the hydrogen that is the largest number of hydrogen atoms across the double bond. And that will then give us the following, right? So it will then give us hydrogen, like so. And so you will then have here hydrogen. So if these are the two hydrogens, then this hydrogen from the hydrogen bromide will therefore sit like here. And after it's set there, then you have, um, right, this particular carbon atom that is going to be bonded to the other atom from the hydrogen bromide. It's going to be bonded to the bromine atom. And you have Br, Br, like so. And with that said, then we continue and we bond like so. Okay. And so what is the meaning of all this here? Right, so this becomes uh, what you call the main product. And so let us write down the names. So first and foremost, this one is called uh, propene. And uh, this one here is called the hydrogen bromide. Hydrogen bromide. Okay, so this is called hydrogen bromide and this is called uh, propene. And uh, the last one then is called um, 2 bromopropane. Right, it is called 2 bromo. 2 bromopropane. Like so. Okay. And this here is uh, actually the main product. The main product of this particular uh, chemical equation. Now, this, the fact that this hydrogen is bonded to the carbon um, on one side of the double bond um, with the most um, hydrogen atoms, so that's where this hydrogen is going to be bonded, is due to um a result by the uh by russian by the russian scientist right the is a, a result by the russian scientist right russian scientist this russian scientist is called vladimir Right, Vladimir Markovnikov. Vladimir Markovnikov. Okay, so the Markovnikov's rule. The Markovnikov. 
Macaw's rule. Right, what does the Makovnikov's rule state? So it states as follows during during the addition of a hydrogen halide HX where the X represents either chlorine, bromine, or iodine to, to an asymmetrical, right, asymmetrical, asymmetrical alkane. Now, point one, the hydrogen atom bonds to the to the carbon atom with the most right with the most. or do not want to use the word with the most, use the word with larger number of hydrogen atoms, like so. Now, moreover, the X group, Right, something called the X group. Bonds to the carbon atom <clears throat> with the least with the least. hydrogen atoms so that's what we have that is what we have so this is what I call Markovnikov's rule that we actually used in this case to um, analyze these um, and get the results so um, in view of uh, some of the uh, um, most uh, basic uh, reactions that we can most certainly do, right, and this was a, a very easy example, right, that's enough for now, and goodbye to you.